Hey everyone, Chrissy at Pinnovate here. Uh, we are going to be doing this adorable little Pikachu painting. Um, if you needed to order a kit to follow along, you can get it at our website, www.pinnovate.ca. All right, so to get set up to do this painting, you want to make sure that you have your painting area covered. So either newspaper, garbage bag, something like that. Uh, maybe have some wipes nearby or paper towel, that's always handy. And have an apron or an old paint shirt as well. Um, your kit is going to include your paint colors, a Sharpie, a vinyl, and your canvas. You are going to need a pencil and some paint brushes. Our first step is we are gonna paint this whole thing yellow, yellow Pikachu color. All right, so when you're painting, you want to make sure that the paint is nice and thin. You want to give it a nice flat coat, nothing too thick or it's not going to dry properly. So just go ahead, have fun with it, and off we go. Don't forget your edges. have our nice yellow coat on there make sure that this dries again so nice thin coat no big lumpy spots make sure that this dries before we move on you can either just let it sit and dry or if you wanted to speed it up you can use a hair dryer and blow it dry nice and quick thanks okay so before we move on we have our yellow coat on there now we want to make sure that this dries so you can either just let it hang out for a little bit while you go do something else or you can use a blow dryer and speed it up but this part has to be very, very dry before we move on to the next step. All right, so our yellow is nice and dry and we're gonna move on to our next step, which is going to be our vinyl. So we have a cute little Pikachu cut out here and we just have to transfer this guy onto here. So with a vinyl, this is almost like a sandwich sticker. There's a top, then there's the white part, and then there's a backing as well. So to peel these apart, you want to gently peel the backing off. Okay, and then the white is going to stick to our front transfer tape. There we go, just like that. Now, with our Pikachu and our transfer tape, we're going to line him up in the very bottom right corner, right to the edges. Line him up, there we go. He's right in the corner, right down there. Now this part, we're going to give him a nice flat squish right on there. We want the white vinyl to stick to our canvas. So don't be afraid to give him a good rub. All right, and then here, all we have to do now is peel off our transfer tape. To do that, we're going to peel it flat and backwards. Okay, if there's any spots that try to peel up any of the white, just give them another little rub down. All right, there's our Pikachu. So the next thing we're going to do is we're actually going to cover this whole thing with blue, which is our background color. So same rules as before, you want to do a nice flat, thin coat so it dries well. If you find that the blue's not quite covering the yellow quite how you want, do one coat, let it dry, and then do a second coat, okay? And we're going to cover up the Pikachu right on top of the white. Nice, thin, flat coat. Now we're gonna get the edges as well, except where the white vinyl is touching the side. So we are not going to get this corner or this bottom corner, but anywhere that the blue is going to the edge, you want to paint that on there as well. All 
All right, so there's my first coat. I'm gonna let it dry and then do a second coat. Okay, so I have two coats of blue on here and it is completely dry. Uh, the next part we're going to do is we're gonna start peeling out little parts of our vinyl in, in here. So we're going to peel out the smallest part of the eye. You can use uh, your nail. Um, if you have a toothpick, that's really handy as well. So we wanna peel out the smallest little part of the eye. Sometimes it's tricky to see, but do your best. Let's see, I think it's here. There we go. So just the tiny, tiniest little pieces. We also want to peel out his mouth. He's just gonna peel off just like a sticker. And his nose. go and then both of his cheeks There's one side All right, two eyes, a nose, mouth, and cheeks. So, now with this, we're going to paint his eyes, the smallest part, white. Now you just need a tiny little bit and a very small brush. Again, so same sort of technique, you want to do a very light, thin coat. If there's too much paint on there, it is not going to dry and the vinyl won't peel off properly. You're better to do two thin coats than one very thick one. So two, two thin coats of white, perfect. And now we're going to do his mouth and his cheeks red. So make sure that your paint is nice and flat so it's going to dry nice and even. Now for his nose, instead of painting, you actually have a Sharpie in your kit. So you're actually just going to color it in. There you go. All right, so we have the white, the black and the red on there. So the next part we're going to peel are the rest of his eyes. So he has nice big black eyes. So we're going to peel that part out. Again, you can pick this off with your fingers or a toothpick works really well. All right, there's his eyes. Now they look a little silly being yellow. So all we're going to do again with our Sharpie is just color that in where the yellow is. Do not go on top of your white paint, but do your best to color around it. There we go, Pikachu's eyes are looking much better. All right, now the next part we get to peel is we're gonna peel right from the corner. And we have to peel his face and part of his ears and then part of his tail out. So we're just gonna peel this nice and gently, just like a Band-Aid or a great big sticker.
great. There we go. So we still have a little bit of vinyl left, but we have Pikachu's face and tail peeled off there. If you find that the vinyl has peeled any of your yellow paint off, you can always go back in and touch it up at the end. Okay, we have a little bit more work to do with our Sharpie now. Uh, we have to outline his cheeks and his mouth. So with your Sharpie on the cheeks, you're just going to go right on the very, very edge just to give it a solid black line so he looks kind of like his cartoon self. There's one side. Okay, there's his cheeks. Now for his mouth, same thing. Just go right around the edge. And there's his mouth. The next part we need to do is the last bit of vinyl that's on there, we need to trace where the edge is. So with a trusty pencil, you are going to go right around the edge of this edge of the vinyl. And I want you to just trace, trace the whole inside edge. All right, now once that edge is traced, we get to peel off that last bit of vinyl on there. So you should have a nice line, a nice pencil line, and a nice blue edge. This is what we're looking for. There's our Pikachu so far. He's just missing his black edge. So, again with our Sharpie, we're just gonna go in and we're gonna color that. So the part from where we put our pencil mark to the blue, we're just gonna color that with Sharpie. There is our Pikachu. A couple tips, tips and tricks for this is to take your time with the Sharpie. Make sure that you're not going out of the lines and enjoy it. And there is our final product of our Pikachu painting. Thank you so much for following along. Uh, we would love to see your work. If you follow us on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, YouTube, and please send us your photos on Instagram at Pinovate. Hope you had a great time. Enjoy.